Hi, I'm Tim Pennington, editor of Products Finishing Magazine. I recently visited the U.S. Bureau of Engraving and Printing to see their very unique plating process. The Bureau of Engraving and Printing is a government agency within the United States Department of the Treasury that designs and produces a variety of security products for the United States government, most notable of which is a Federal Reserve note or paper money for the Federal Reserve, which is the nation's largest central bank. In addition to paper currency, the BEP produces treasury securities, military commissions, and award certificates, invitations, and admission cards, and many types of identification forms and cards and other special documents for a variety of government agencies. The BEP does not produce coins. All coinage is produced by the United States Mint. With production facilities in Washington, D.C. and Fort Worth, Texas, the Bureau of Engraving and Printing is the largest producer of government security documents in the United States. Okay. Hi, my name is Steve Olshevy. I work for the Department of Treasury Bureau of Engraving and Printing. We are a currency manufacturer for the United States. Uh, we uh, print Federal Reserve notes that uh, are used throughout the world. We uh, print approximately 7 billion notes a year and we do that. Uh, we make the currency printing plates here at my operation in plate making. I have a nickel plating side and a chrome plating side in which we make approximately 500 plates a year to print those 7 billion notes. Something that makes our plating operation a little different than most plating operations is the fact that we uh, we're actually growing a plate really thick and we want to remove it from the substrate whereas in most applications you're growing your plating to a, a surface to uh, protect it and beautify it or whatever case you're looking for. We actually want to separate the two pieces so we'll use the, the actual plate or plated surface in another application. Uh, it, it, the plate is approximately 40 thousandths thick after we grow it and it takes about 17 hours to get to that thickness. Alright, so we also have the chrome plating side which uh, we, have, we plate our, our nickel substrate plates to get the life and the wear they need on the press because the presses operate under approximately 28 tons of pressure. We need that hard chrome surface to be able to get the wear resistance we need out of that plate. It's a typical hexavalent chrome bath. Uh, we put uh, approximately three tenths of chrome on the plate, which is about eight, eight to 12 microns of thickness. Uh, and uh, we get that beautiful chrome surface, frosted chrome surface on it. Besides the currency printing plates that we make for use on the press, we make several other plates for use, such as the passports. Uh, we also make these CRBAs, which is the Certificates of Birth Abroad. And we also have a significant uh, miscellaneous program we do here, which is all your special printed evolutions that they will offer the public uh, out of the visitor center sales and on their website.